Want beer? Morning. Good morning. Morning. What are you so happy about? Well, I'm surrounded by the people I love. Oh, at last. Well, good news. Dear Mrs. Masood, I just wanted to inform you you have been successfully added to our list of approved contractors. Yay! We got it. We got the City Museum Group contract. Brilliant. We should all go out tonight and celebrate. Amira, me, you. We're busy tonight. <sighs> Hello, Miss Alaquin. Yes, Ian. Well, everyone apart from Masood, why? Okay, I'll call him. Oh, see him. Said he needs to speak to all of us. <coughs> yes, I, I'm very much looking forward to it as well. <laughs> Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> Their function manager is coming over for a tasting session next week, and they've already got three events that they want us to do. <laughs> well done, <laughs> Mum. Come here. <laughs> Oh, the office is never this friendly when I'm here. Yeah, well, Zainab has just scored us a new contract with the City Museum Group. Oh, wow. excellent. Well done, you. Thank you, Jane. See, Ian, you're not the only one with connections, huh? <laughs> Good. All helps improve the value of the company. So we can think about getting that new blast chiller. Oh, well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Well, you never know when you need to call someone down quick. New equipment, new contracts. I mean, it all adds to the value of the company portfolio. Oh, we haven't got a portfolio. We're just a little business still finding its way. What, are you expecting a share dividend? <laughs> <laughs> can we? What are you up to, Ian? I need to release some of my assets. What? I need to sell my shares in Masala Queen. I need to liquidate some assets in order to complete the refurbishment of the CAF. I mean, I'm calling it a bit of bill quantitative easing. I mean, I've looked at all the options, and this is the only one that makes sense when I take it into consideration with all my other investments. Your insurance will cover the refurbishment? Yeah. You were temporarily uninsured. Ian, I didn't know. There's no way I'd have got the work what? started. Well, what's the emergency? Ian's closing us down. No, I am not. Yes, you are. Ian wants to sell his shares in Masala Queen. Why? It was going so well. Why wouldn't you insure the calf? It was a cost-cutting exercise. Oh, you idiot. Not insured? So because of your momentous cock-up, so because of your, your, your meanness, we're all being thrown to the wolves, are we? So we can save some no, two-bit cafe no, of no, yours. I've got no other no, no, option. No, no, as long as Ian is OK, right? You, look, no, what? Ian. It's not about Ian. It's about his family and what's right for them. He's been worried sick about this. It's not a decision he just made up. We need that calf up and running. I've got, I've got to go and sort the kids' tea. Yeah, I'm coming with you, love. Everything I've got is already in. Can't we borrow against our contracts? There's no room in our pricing for extra interest charges. We'd be working to break even at I best. I can't believe he didn't have insurance. Maybe we'd be better off with a new partner. No Ian. No Jane. But we need to work out how much it's going to cost to buy him out. Let's just refuse to buy him out. What if he sells to someone else? A new partner might decide to change things. And you knew nothing about his plans to sell? No. Jane didn't say a thing to her little brother? I said no. <sighs> Oi, don't do that. Got anything to say, say it to my face. Which one? I am not the one keeping secrets here. Look, Mum, please, this is not the time to fall out. We need to work together, be united and avoid any personal distractions. Really? No personal distractions? I think we can help Ian out as friends. As friends? And we'll all benefit. How? We don't lose Miss Ola Queen. Ian will be in our debt. And it'll bring us all closer together. Now, this next stage, it, I mean, it's all about the negotiating, OK? Then make some sort of silly offer. Oh, we'll uh, do you a favour, we'll take it off your hands. And obviously I will then counter with, well, we've had interest from a third party. And what if they don't? Well, Zainab can't wait to get rid of me, can she? There we go, phase one. Uh -huh. <clears throat> ah, that's what I like to see, nice and punctual. Well, I'm... We are all very busy people, aren't we? We've got lots of nice new contracts to sign, and obviously I've got the, uh, the relaunch of the CAF. Now, I've been uh, having some thoughts about the value of the company. Mm -hmm. So have we. Right. Make me an offer. Nothing. Right, well, I was... Pardon? Nothing. Nothing? What? You're not going to offer to take it off my hands? No. So you want me to 
sell it to a third party, because I'm telling you, I have had very strong interest. I'm sure you haven't. Besides, we could make it very difficult for you to sell to anyone else. Now, we do have another suggestion. None of us individually have the money to buy you out, but Masala Queen will lend you the money to rebuild the cafe. That sounds like a, a great idea. What, and we should helping out the bills? <sighs> Why? We know how important the cafe is to you. No, I'm not going to lie to you, Ian. This idea got mixed responses. Some of us felt it was a bad idea. Some of us felt better than Ian, you know. Mm, I can guess which one you were. But we all agree that Masala Queen has a great future. And it's a shame to break it up before it's really got going. Look on it as partners helping one another. What is it they say about keeping your friends close? Yeah, and your enemies closer. I'll, um... I'll have to think about it. Take your time. But not too long. Why are you doing this? It's like you said. We don't want to lose Masala Quinn. No, he's up to something. I don't trust him. Don't worry about him. I can make sure he behaves himself. Hard at it. <sighs> risk assessments. Well, you've got to know the risks. Never know what might happen. Any news from Ian? Why are you so keen to help Ian? I told you it makes sense. And making sense means helping Ian. It means helping my sister. It means we'll all be brought closer together. It means keeping your mouth shut about the other night. Why should I? Because the sooner you forget it ever happened, the better for everyone. I get it. I keep quiet. And you look like the Good Samaritan. Exactly. <laughs> well, Ian, he says yes. You can get the tickets. What are you doing? Huh? You spying on someone? No. Come on, who is it? Nobody. <laughs>